This Bigfoot sighting is an old sighting. It comes out of Shasta County, California from the spring of 1977. The witness says that his family and him went camping on Lake Shasta and that they stayed at a campground called Antler Campground. His family and him walked over to a cove on the lake where they had a family picnic. But after the picnic, that him and his cousin wanted to stay and fish the cove. While his little sister Kim also wanted to stay and fish. The rest of the family went back to the boat dock. Now after a while, his little sister wanted to go back to the family. So he started walking her back to the boat dock where their older sister was and that Kim wanted to be with her. That from the cove to the boat dock was about a quarter of a mile. Now he says that while he was taking her to the boat dock, he says he heard something walking with them. The witness said if he stopped, then the other sounds would stop also. Seeing that he didn't see anything, so he wasn't for sure if it was anything or not. So he just kept walking to the dock. After dropping his sister off, the witness started back to the cove. The witness said after a few minutes into the return trip that he started to hear the footsteps again. But that now the footsteps were closer and that he could see some kind of movement in the shadows. Thing as he kept walking, that it sounded like it was getting closer to him. Saying that he stopped again and listened, when all of a sudden something came crashing through the brush, heading straight at him, stating that he just stood there, maybe out of fear or just the surprise of it. Saying as he was watching this thing come right at him, it stopped short of him by about five feet. He says at this time he could see plainly what was standing there, but that he really had a hard time believing what he was seeing. He noticed that this creature had big reddish brown eyes that just seemed to stare right through him. Now saying that this really creeped him out, he then said he noticed that this thing had huge muscular arms and very large hands. Just huge, he said. Now as his eyes lowered down toward the ground, he saw that the feet on this creature was huge. Then as the witness started lifting his eyes back up, he started to scan this creature, saying that this creature had big calves and thigh muscles. Now as his eyes kept scanning upwards, he says that this creature was definitely a male, saying that the creature was covered with dark brown hair, that he didn't notice if its head was pointed or not, that he was just too close to the creature to see the top of its head. He turned to his cousin and said, look, as he pointed. Now at this time, he says that his cousin gave out a loud scream and started running and jumped into the lake, saying that he gave a yell and did pretty much the same thing, saying they swam out into the center of the cove while the creature just stood there watching them. He says that his cousin started swimming to the dock, but that he stayed where he was, that he guessed that he was just curious about this thing, but saying that he was very scared at the same time. Saying that this creature looked back into the cove and that like it was startled or something, then it took off up the hill. Saying that the hill was 40 to 45 degrees while being covered in brush and trees, but that this creature was fast. Saying it covered 100 to 200 yards in just a few seconds. And then it was gone. Now that was a sighting, don't you think? So what do you think about this sighting? Drop me a comment down below. If you like this video, then please give a big thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification button so you can keep up with all of our latest videos. And thanks for watching those endless mysteries.